Hello, Lakewood. This is your superintendent, Maggie Nedzwicki. I wanted to share with our families a district COVID-19 update. Some have asked how we make our decisions. Key metrics that go into deciding whether to require masks indoors or not come from the guidance of the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the Ohio Department of Health, and through that information, we receive Ohio data, county data, and zip code data. Here is an example of the data we use. As a reminder, the CDC, ODH, and CCBH have all submitted guidance and recommendations. I decided to change our mask policy at the beginning of the school year due to the high transmission rate in Cuyahoga County and our own local zip code data that can be found again on the Ohio Department of Health website. So what's different this year? There are no executive orders or statutory language. Why is this important to understand? The landscape has changed for decision-making. Generally, without an actual order or mandate in place for the state of Ohio, county health department, or federal government, each board of education determines the rules it wants to put in place for COVID-19. As you may be aware, the CDC does have guidance in place that requires individuals riding public transportation to wear masks, and that includes school buses. So let's go back to our number one goal. Our number one goal is all in all the time. So as a reminder, due to the high transmission levels in Cuyahoga County and Lakewood, the following safety precautions are in place. All students, staff, and visitors pre-K to 12 will wear masks while in the building, except while eating and drinking. Students have Students who have a positive COVID-19 test will follow isolation protocols. Because we are masked, students who are exposed to a COVID-19 positive person will receive guidance from the district nurse on the recommendations for quarantining per the Ohio Department of Health and the CDC. Because there are no executive orders or statutes mandating quarantine for healthy individuals, we can only strongly encourage families to follow best practices if a student is exposed. Because of this, we will no longer be tracking quarantine cases on our dashboard. So what will we do? We will provide staff parents with the most updated guidance from the health professionals. We will provide home instruction to support learning during quarantines. We will send staff students home that show symptoms of being ill. We will utilize hospital grade air filters. We will continue to maximize fresh air inputs. We will maximize our cleaning protocols in high traffic areas. And we will post staff student positive cases on our school dashboard as required by the Ohio Department of Health. What can you do? Talk to your student about why it is important for us to mask. This is a great opportunity to let your students know that they are showing empathy for others while masking. Each of us never knows who around us is at a higher risk for complications due to COVID-19. Share with your student that if they need assistance academically, socially, or emotionally to reach out to their teacher, counselor, or principal. Modeling for our students to advocate through strong communication skills is important. We have many support systems in place to work with our students and families. Please take advantage of that. Keep your student home when they are showing any symptoms of being ill. Global awareness in the classroom involves teaching students about different nations and cultures, as well as their civic duties and rights, both locally and globally. Staying home when you are not feeling well is being a good citizen. Focus Forward Lakewood, we are constantly learning how to live during a pandemic and we will get better as the year moves on. Have a great day.